Okay, this is Temple OS 5-Minute Random Code Walkthrough, Episode 72, and I'm your host, Terry Davis. <clears throat> okay, we are in Eagle Dive. This is the uh, flight simulator. Um, the frame grabber grabs 8 frames a second. Um, the screen is being updated 30 frames a second. So you're seeing eight frames because that's what it's making. It's making the video as as it's running, saving to disk. Um, so this is the animate task, which um, runs in the background, and uh, it has to propel the eagle forward. I don't ha normally you would do a. Uh, a flight dynamic of an airplane I I didn't really try hard to make flight dynamics of an eagle anyway um, this is doing screen to world and it's reversing the transformation for the view direction it's going in the opposite order and um, then once you once you reverse it, uh, the transformation, screen the world, then um, that gives you the, uh, then you add to the XYZ of the eagle. This is the master XYZ of the, uh, the location of the eagle. Um, it calls this, uh, this does a rotation. We use four by four matrices for the projection. That allows for a uh, a translation to be included. It's a little trick they um, you do four by four. The last coordinate you add in, and that allows for a uh, a translation is an offset. So you have you have a rotation and skewing. We would never skew and and you have an offset um, and uh, anyway so it turns out there's about uh, three different places you can add an offset you can add an offset in the rotation you can add an offset in the device context and you can add an offset in the uh, a lot of the graphics routines take a, a XYZ anyway uh, so um, what else do we do we check for we check if the eagle has captured a fish. Um, so we, uh, is that what we're doing here? I don't think that's what we're doing. What are we doing? Yes, we are doing that. We're going through the fish. Oh, if the eagle is underwater, then we, uh, if the eagle is underwater, we check for a fish. We square the x distance, y distance, and z dif distance and we compare it to five five units squared so we we compare a squared distance against a squared di distance oh not x y and z just x and y and uh we add to the game score we mute the music and play a a, a tone um vmware doesn't have, doesn't support uh pc speaker anymore they used to support it. Now, if the um, if the angle is rising or falling, then we increase or decrease the speed. So this is some somewhat of a flight dynamic. Uh, anyway, uh, so I studied control systems, and you can get um, you can get a sophisticated uh, dynamic for Cessnas and stuff like that. I, I just I don't I didn't really care that much. Yeah, it's ridiculous. The flight. This is just. Uh, I picked a dynamic that was fun to fly. It's not at all realistic. I looked at some footage from a uh, an eagle flying, and it did not look at all like this. This is a lot more fun. Anyway, who wants to fly a Cessna when you can fly like this? Anyway, it is a lot more fun than a Cessna. Anyway. So 